What's your name, please? My name is Abdul Aziz Adnan. And could you tell me how long you've actually lived in the UK? I've been since 1996. So, could you tell me a little about um, what we've just been talking about, about fitna? Could you explain that? Fitna is mean, you know, if a woman cover her face, so that she will not get attention for other people. Uh, the people will not get attractive by her because the beauty of her, she cover it. So people will not see the face. But if a woman, you know, someone see her face and she's a pretty, so of course the people will keep looking at her. That's why it's the best way the woman, she has to keep her face. You know, the problem here is the misunderstanding. Right. The people, they don't understand the religion well. If I know a little bit about religion and I start giving fatwa and I start saying blah, blah, blah. But always is the best to follow the, the, the sunnah or the way of the prophet. Right. I, I, so what you're saying is that the words fatwa, the words jihad are misinterpreted. Mm -hmm. Yes, exactly. Exactly. Right. Some people, they've been missing the, the meaning of, uh, you know, uh, fatwa, the meaning of, as, as you mentioned, jihad. And hijab and niqab and as well. And hijab and niqab is the same. Yeah. Right. When people misinterpret, you know, interpret, you know, interpret what they say, so they just have wrong idea, and they get, they lead other people to get confused too. Which you know, because you know, in in a religion, uh, in a religion way, religion is, is 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 very complicated. You have to have full understanding about it. You have to read more about it. You have to know what you're talking about. Then you know how you can approach other, how you make other people they they believe what you say. How is this in, how is this understanding lost in this country? Do you think? What you mean uh, of the religion? Mm, to be honest, there is many reasons for that. Some people, the the people, as a Muslim, you mean? Um, as a Muslim. As a Muslim, because uh, people who grow up in this country uh, and they haven't got enough understanding and they haven't been taught well uh, th th there is the problem for that so they don't understand and where this is how they get lost because you just you know you're not practicing <coughs> and you're not ab uh, uh, you know approach what you know because you don't know nothing so th is are, are they real Muslims or are they just misguided Muslims would you say no 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 I can't to be honest I can I can't I can't I am not the one who can decide they are Muslim or not Muslim. If they recite the kalima, La ilaha illallah, Muhammad Rasulullah, there is only one Allah and the, and the Prophet, his messenger, they are Muslim. Even if they don't practice, this is between them and Allah. It's a relationship between you and your, your creator. So you can say to someone, even if he's Muslim, if he doesn't pray, if he doesn't uh, practice Islam, you, you're not allowed to say to him he's not Muslim. Right. Because you have no right to say that. <coughs> so you'd say they're just misguided then? They're misguiding and, and, uh, and they have lack of understanding. If, if they've been taught in the right way and they have enough understanding, they will practice, you know, as a good Muslim and they, they will be good Muslim. But they are Muslim in the end of the day. In terms of the hijab, then you you view that there's there's no reason why a woman should not wear it. Then, well, you know, no, I think for hijab, the woman she's supposed to wear hijab because you know, unless if she doesn't know. Because if you if you go if you go in hadith, which means the words be related by by the prophet, it's everything. It been said by the Prophet. This is called hadith. In hadith, you know, if you hear many hadith, you know, a woman actually, she just open her hair, showing other people her beauty, uh, attractive other people's. She get gonna for that. She will get sense for that. Right. Yeah, because in Islam, a woman she's not allowed to do that. You have to cover your face. You know, your hair. I mean, at least your face. But if you didn't, so. Doesn't mean you know you're gonna be in bad trouble.